Hey guys, David Acosta here, International Executive with Paycation UK. This network marketing school is coming to you live today regarding the topic of meetings. Now we're going to jump straight into it. This is going to be a very quick video talking about meetings in network marketing now and specifically for Paycation. Now we have a saying in network marketing which goes, more meetings means more money. And it's very simple. Now, again, this is not for bragging rights, but the reason I am the number one income earner in our team in vacation is because I've been to the most meetings over here in the UK, up and down the country, Mexico, America, Baltimore. Um, and again, that's not for bragging rights. It's to give you the secret as to making a lot of money in your network marketing business, i.e. vacation, by attending meetings. Now, what's valuable about attending meetings? You would think maybe someone like myself obviously knows how to explain the business and obviously already making money. You would feel maybe he doesn't need to attend meetings. But that's definitely not true. The other day, I attended a meeting in London where Shania the song was breaking down the business and I picked up something very valuable. She was talking about uh, how Priceline actually approached vacation, not the other way around. And Priceline already have a room full of attorneys and lawyers who've done all the research needed into making sure that vacation is a legitimate company. So when you have friends and family who say, yes, it's all good and it sounds great, but I need to go home and do my research first. She said, look, don't bother. Don't waste your time. There's no way on earth you could do any more research than a big, powerful organization like Priceline. So that was something new to me and I didn't know that before. And that's something I picked up and add to my arsenal of information and ammo that I can use to help explain the business to my people when they have a, a, a negative criticism like, oh, I need to go home and do some research. So if I didn't attend that meeting because I feel, oh, I know it already, I've heard it all before, I wouldn't have that to my arsenal. That piece of information is going to, be, is going to add to my arsenal and that's going to help me make thousands, if not millions of pounds later on down the future as so I continue to use that. Every time somebody says to me, I need to do my research first, I will have that to, to, to use. So again, it's all about gaining, gaining lots and lots of knowledge, adding it to your arsenal of what to say at the right time to, to the right people. Because that's the difference between uh, the leaders and the followers. The leaders are the ones that have the knowledge. And the way you get the knowledge is by going to these meetings, all these meetings, um, every single meeting you can physically get yourself to, you will always get new information. Now, I've been to maybe over 50 vacation meetings, and I promise you, every single one, I've picked up something new. It may just be that one piece of information that maybe you needed to hear at the time, or just more information to add to your arsenal, um, and it's going to help you in the course of your vacation career. Always, always, always attend meetings, because you'll always pick up new information. Uh, Getting your people to meetings, obviously that's even more powerful because that's the best way to get your people to sign up and join your business through them actually attending meetings and seeing it live themselves. Because it's the way we're wired as a people, we like to feel that there's a lot of people around us doing the same thing. That's something called social proof. Social proof meaning um, if you've got uh, just two people in the room, you're going to feel a bit lonely. I was just two of us here, maybe this thing is not right. But when you've got a hundred, if not a thousand people in the room, you're like, yes, I feel fired up. And that's the place to get fired up. Now, network marketing is not always easy. Now, you may share this opportunity with friends and family, and some may knock you down and say, oh, no, I'm not interested. It looks rubbish. It's too expensive. It's a scam. And we know to expect that. But after a while, that can get you down, especially when that one person who you really want to share this with, and you know it's going to be great for them, and they knock you down. And after a while, that can get a bit draining, and mentally, emotionally, and you need to get yourself picked back up. And it's at meetings where you have a big bunch of people around you that live in the same, um, live in the same dream as you, live in the same focus as you, to help pick you back up. And if you continue to not attend meetings and share this opportunity with people and you maybe get a few knockbacks, after a while you feel so low and you find yourself quitting the business. And then later on you look around and see the friends and family who stayed with it, uh, making huge incomes and enjoying themselves. You're going to think back as to why didn't I stay, stick with it? And one of the reasons you didn't stick with it may be because you didn't attend enough meetings to get you back fired up when you're feeling down. I've never left the vacation event without feeling super fired up. But imagine how you feel when you share it with a friend or family member who you know it's going to be grateful and they knock you down. You don't feel good. So you need meetings to constantly give you that, that level of fire to help you go on the next level of your journey because it's up and down journey. Sometimes you feel great. Sometimes you don't feel so great. And that's where the meetings come in. The other thing is positive peer pressure i remember going to my meeting as a, as a regional and looking up to the nationals who got to stand on stage and i was like oh my days nationals get to stand on stage i want that so i worked 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 hard next event hey i'm a national got to stand on stage wow this feels great oh my days look how much recognition the internationals get 
work, 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 get on stage as an international. And it's a different ball game. It just goes up and up and up. Seeing the other people, your friends and family and associates and colleagues being on stage or getting recognised for being at that next rank pushes you. Positive peer pressure to say, oh, I want to hit that rank. I want to take that next step. So again, guys, really, really strongly urge you to follow the basic fundamentals on network marketing, the three M's, more meetings, more money. Um, more meetings, more money, that's four M's, but the four M's of network marketing. Um, basically, get yourself to as many events and meetings as you can. If you can physically get there, if you can get people there with you, that's even more powerful. You're going to have a better buzz when you've got your friends and family sitting next to you hearing the same information you're hearing. Because you're, you're hearing that, oh, wow, this is great, and they're hearing it too. They're going to want to join. They're going to be um, excited as, at this opportunity as, as much as I am. So, again, guys, that's, uh, that's the end of the video. So, always, always, always attend the meetings. That's where the knowledge is. That's where the leaders become leaders. That's where people get the, the positive um, fire they need to keep going on the next leg of their journey. If they're feeling down to keep them going, getting fired up to give you the positive peer pressure to say, look, I want to get on stage. I want to hit that next rank. I'm keeping an eye on him. I want to, I want to, I see how good he's doing. I want to follow. I want to try and achieve the next step. So thanks a lot, guys. My name is David Acosta. This has been your Network Marketing School regarding meetings and hopefully you guys can get good value from this and you can implement it into your vacation business and we'll see you on the other side.